Skadoosh, and welcome back. Joey Moss with Bad Boy Gaming. Angels and Demons. I've been waiting forever to make a good Angel and Demon deck. I did it in the last standard. It was terrible. I am telling you, it was putrid. And the reason it was putrid, we just didn't have enough cards to make a good Angel Demon deck. Now we really do. Uh, I'm really excited about this one. We're going to run four Ajani's Welcome. This card's just going to gain one life, or we gain one life whenever a creature enters the battlefield under our control. And then we have four Ajani's Pride Mate to combo nicely with that, so Ajani gets pumped up because anytime we gain life, it's getting a plus one, plus one counter on it. Argo's Bloodfast. This thing is pretty sweet. I don't see a lot of people ever playing it, but it's one of the cards I've ran in fairly a decent amount of decks because anytime we're gaining a lot of life, cool, we can dump our life. We pay two life, draw a card. Card advantage is huge, and that's really going to help us. This, this can make uh, deciding factors in a lot of the matches. Only two of, because when you have more than two, you kind of just get stuck with it. There's not much you can do. Two cast downs, just two, just to destroy a creature. History of Benalia times four, which is a really cool card. It allows us to go a tiny bit wide, not too wide, but a little bit wide with some creatures on the battlefield, keep our opponent on their toes. And then also that plus two, plus one perk does benefit. Uh, three Resplendent Angels, not four, not two. Uh, this card is always targeted, though, I've noticed. We're only going to run three. Typically, when I was running four, I mean, this card is not that big. It's a bomb late in the game, but early on in the game, this thing stinks. I mean, it really does, and it dies to just about anything. So we're just going to run three of them, but late game, it's nasty. Four Mortifies, because there's people out there that run creatures and enchantments, believe it or not, and we're going to want to do something about that. We're going to have one Excellence Binding, which is great also. We can exile one of their cards, and they can't cast spells of uh, whatever card we exile with the Binding. Pretty sweet. Spawn of Mayhem, four copies. That's right, a playset. This is one of those new additions from Ravnica Allegiance. It's got Flying and Trample. At the beginning of your upkeep, Spawn of Mayhem deals one damage to each player. Then if you have ten or less life, put a plus one, plus one counter on Spawn of Mayhem. The cool thing about Mayhem... Until I actually played with the card, I didn't realize how good he was. But the longer we are able to stay alive and we have Spawn and Mayhem out, we're going to win because the thing just keeps getting bigger. And then with our other creatures with some life gain and all that stuff, I mean, it's really a really fun card to play with. I, I do like it. Three is of the Scales. It's another one of the cards that we got aid from with the Angel category. Uh, four drop, and we can choose by tapping one mana of either the white or the black. If it's going to get death touch or vigilance till end of turn, we can go both if we wanted to. And it's got afterlife for two, so when it dies, out pops out like uh, a nice 1-1 one, one spirit token, or two of them. Angel of Grace, because sometimes you just need that split second. Bam! Drop this thing in. Angel of Grace is a 5-4. Catch opponent off guard, kill one of his creatures. We just uh, didn't end up losing the game on top of that. And we can also exile Angel of Grace, and uh, our life total becomes 10. Pretty cool. Three Dawnbringers. This is going to be one of the bombs in the deck. I mean, it's got Flying First Strike and Lifelink, and other angels get plus one, plus one, and have Lifelink. That's pretty huge. Also, we have nine planes, eight swamps, four Godless Shrines, four Isolated Chapels. Sideboards are going to be three Duress, Honor Guard, Diamond Mare times three, another Excellence Binding, Kaya's Wrath times two, two Eldest Reborns, and one Immortal Sun. That is a total of 25 lands, 18 creatures, 17 non-creatures. But just keep in mind, we got a lot of stuff that makes creatures. All right, guys, let's get into the build. Let's have some fun. Showtime. Inexorable? 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 What's an X-Ripple? Two Lawnbringers, Angel. Oh, that is really slow. We can't we can't keep that. Unless we want to lose. I don't want to lose, so there's that. Need something a bit more uh, a bit more quick. A bit more, bit more haste like. Mulligan the first. That looks better. Another Johnny. I mean if, I guess. I mean don't keep us alive a bit longer. It's all about living. Uh, Ender's tapped. Two of Johnny's welcome. Pretty nice. Get a double trigger with a, a double trig, double trigger with our uh, a Johnny. If we can blast a Johnny out here, drop both the Johnny's welcomes. Hopefully, do get a Johnny. That'd be sweet. 
Opponent's ring is mono white. We got Penalia. Great core. I'm going to check that out. He's getting for two lifelink. Sorrow on the scales. We definitely gotta remove that. Before it becomes a big threat. Down goes Frazier. Alright, can we just top deck a land? Crikey. 25 lands, we should be able to top deck a land here. Thank you very much. Um, I guess we can go Seraph. Sixteen. That life link is sweet, or not life link, but life gain from a Johnny's Welcome. I never really played with it too much, but it's pretty cool. Next one's binding. Well, I'm glad I dropped that first before I dropped spawn, because we would be sitting with a spawn dead in our hand. Next one in chapel. You gonna try to take that out too, bro? Got another one for you. Watch it drops another excellence binding. I mean, that would devastate us. Dombringer. Yikes. attack. We need an answer for his Dawnbringer, and then we're doing good, or even get our Angel back. I'd rather kill a Dawnbringer first, though. Whoa. That thing's beast mode. No, we do get the plus and plus one counters on him. Oof, not what we wanted. It ends up killing us. We are at eight. No attacks. Three spawn of mayhems. Can we pull this one off? Other creatures you control gain double strike. I think we're screwed. Another spawn. We didn't need another spawn. We're going for it, though. Five life. I cannot pay no life here. Good thing is we do have a 6-6 six, six to block that. Oh, that's big. I think it'd be smarter than that. 40 life. That excellent binding really messed us up. Lyra! Keep us alive, baby. If only you had, like, vigilance. If only you had vigilance, Spawn. Alright, we just need some creature destruction and we're doing good. Maybe. We're kind of screwed. Alright. I think he's got it.
I think he's got it. Oh, yeah, right for my life, like, would he survive? Barely, though. Decline. Yeah, I think he made a big boo boo there. We should, wow, we should not have won that one. That's pretty crazy. Um. Yeah, we should go to attack like that. Boom! A trample. Pretty nasty. Can't draw any life yet. Or I can't draw any cards yet by giving life. I can't really draw a card. Uh oh. This has turned out to be a really cool match. Okay, I think we're doing phenomenal here. Attacking, he would just lose a creature. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, no. Another land. You gotta be kidding me. Another land, holy crap. What? I can't even draw any more lands or we die. Holy crap. Well, we got all of our use out of that, that's for sure. He really should have attacked there. I think he would have won. No. Are you serious? Another land. That's just insanity. Four lands in a row. Wizards does not like me. Alright. If he got a kill spell, that would stink. Okay, cool. I think we got this one. Yeah, it should be in the books. But we looked out. Really, really cool matchup here. I honestly thought we were going to lose in in inexorable. Inex I know inexorable. I don't know inex inexorable. We uh are the champions of the world. I guess we just blocked this dude. Good game, my friend. Good game. I don't want to say anything too early, but yeah, it's a good game. Another land. Wow. That is stupid. Whatever. What was that? Five or six lands in the end in a row. Unbelievable. I'm surprised we won that. Skadoosh! Let's rock. In words of Al Bundy. Let's rock. Angels and demons, baby. Let's do this. Ooh. Oh, look at Mr. Combo pieces coming out early. So a Johnny's Pride Mate with uh, a Johnny's Welcome is just ideal. That is amazing. Now we can start things off with our Godless. We'll pay the two life and drop a Johnny's Welcome. The ideal start right there. And a Benalian hand. I mean, you can't really go wrong with that. He said, oops. I don't know what he oopsed about. That's okay. He's a little pooper ooper. We can go with a Johnny's Pride Mate. Game that life. Put a plus, uh, uh, plus one, plus one counter on it. Okay, we're up against some kind of artifact, though. It should be interesting. And we shall go with another planes and go Benalia. Odds are that will be countered. Nope. Anticipate. Beautiful. Pink. Uh, 
synergize as well with this whole spiel here. And will we chump block or no? Chump blocks. So we take out this creature. Now, right now, I need to get into some uh, bigger and badder cards. We need some of our angels or demons to pop out. I think we're running a total of between the two. It was four, four. It's like 12. 12 is 12 or 13. Diamond Mirror, cool card. Ooh, pretty big. This thing just keeps getting bigger. I think we're going... Probably Godless Shrine here. Or, we I mean, we really could... Of an enter tapped. Um, I guess. I guess we can drop it, whatever. I was gonna do cast down on this, but that's alright. Next one, I'll cast it down, and that, that should seal it. Or actually, yeah. yeah. Yes, affirmative, yes. We get in for two. Is this a mono blue build? Mono blue and artifacts? Destroy all non artifact creatures. If that card pops up, we're in trouble. Okay. Only we had Mortify, eh? Shut Poopy. That is quite a bit of damage. She's at seven. So one more around, and that should be it. I would love to just cast you down. A Mortify would be nice. Let's pop a Mortify. All tap creatures on his hand. That's brutal. Hey, this guy is just having some fun with me right now. Oof. Can we top deck Mortify? That'd be beautiful. No, we cannot. But we can drop big old Dawnbringer, and that will definitely mess things up. No counter, baby. We can't have a counter. Got it. You've been playing counters the whole time. And now you want a counter? You son of a biscuit. You son of a biscuit. All right, well, at least we got our creatures back in our hand. That's all right. Mira, you're so beautiful. Why'd you have to get countered? All right, we should be in good shape here. We just go with uh, a Johnny first. Do not counter, you sick, sadistic individual. Hey, I needed that. All right, we can drop this. Gain a life. Now, next turn, I mean, he needs to bounce this back or something. Otherwise, he's going to be in trouble. Gosh, can you not? Can you not? Every time I get a tiny bit of arrogance, you come and spit on me. Tom Bringer, nice. Uh, but he could tap it down again, so we just got to chill. Man, that time of ice is really irritating, huh? Holy smokes. So let's keep that. Lyra next turn. I don't think he has another counter. Tezzeret's Cruel Machinist. So this match would have been over had we had uh, not cast downs in hand, but the other guy. Mortify. Thank you, Mortify. All right. Goodbye. Give my guy back, brah. What you gonna do now? Play it? We got Tezzeret Cruel Machinist. Draw a card. Alright, fair.
We got it. Almost. Almost, but no cigar. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, we do have enough. Uh, yeah, should be alright. Chinese pride, mate. Hopefully, it counters that. Uh, do we really want to pay that? I'll let it resolve. And then pump this up. Hopefully, build a swing in here. That's what I'm talking about. All right, we get an angel out of that too. I think. And life off it. We're at 30. I like the artwork on that. Yeah, ooh, the other tether. Oh man. That's crazy. Lyra will win this match, my friend. Go to Johnny, and then we can Dawnbring her afterwards. Got him. Wrecked him, damn near killed him. So we take the first one. It's kind of a brutal matchup right now, honestly. Uh, we definitely want the other Mortify in here. Colors we bore, I'm not so sure about. Ixalan's binding, for sure. This doesn't really help too much. Um, okay, take out the cast down. Probably take out both cast downs. And we just run with that. Uh, the Immortal Sun, mm, he might be countered. The rest. The rest would be fun in here. I guess the other cast down can come out. And let's rock. I honestly, maybe just, it's just one duress. We don't really need to get crazy with it. Although duress would be ideal against uh, you know, some of those enchantments and whatnot that he has. But with four mortifies, I think we should be safe. We should be good. Let's see how we do. Johnny's welcome. And history of Benalia. I like Benalia because it just keeps dropping stuff and it's going to force him, you know, to make some kind of moves. And two Benalias usually ends up winning quick. We'll see how it, we'll see how it pans out. Oh, cool. So our scales. Um, I guess we do kind of have to go this round. Let's go to Johnny's Welcome. You can counter that already, are you? Holy smoke. You could. He did. Well, I'm glad he actually did it on that. Cause we, that's not one of our win cons. I mean, I guess it is. Pumping a Johnny up a lot is pretty cool. But it's not necessarily like the way we're going to win it. Um, got a little shrine here. It matters half. Because we have no two, turn two. And then we can isolate a chapel next turn. Benalia. Perfect. He may be tapped out. Yeah, he's tapped out. Benalia. Two Benalias, baby. And it's hard to mess with two Benalias. He scooped it. All right. Not bad. Let's get into another. That's right. Caracol. Let's do this. We got history. We got mortify. I like. I this is not bad. I like this, but it could be a little better. Some primate action, you know, all that good stuff. See how it pans out. Nice. Look at that. Look at that, me boy. We got the Johnny's Parade meat. You know, you need some life gain up here. At least it makes for a turn, too. So we got White Weenie, Boros.
1919. Another isolated chapelle. Making a Johnny. He doesn't really do much right now. You have to buy up some time, get uh, history of Benalia. Goes with, uh, okay, Legion Landing. Good play, good play. He's gonna flip it right now already. That's crazy, my friend. I cannot block that because we're gonna need something to have more pride, mate. Well, him flipping that early, that's, that's huge. Cast down's all right. All right, let's compete with him. My drop in Benalia. Right now we can really use some life gain. That would be pretty sweet. If we could just get a little bit of life gain. I mean, you got two Mortifies and Cast Down. But he's going to start pumping out these tokens. It's going to come down to will his deck hold up against us or not. I don't think it will. Catching him with both. And he, yeah, he's been dropped. This will block his bodyguard. Probably could take out this guy. Hmm. No, let's just drop a uh, spawn of man. No attack. We got cast down for him. He's gonna try to go wide on us, but it's just I don't think he's got it. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see, baby. We'll see. Nice. Okay. I mean, we can... Honestly... I better hold up. Let's just go at Respondent for right now. I'll keep Chaos down in the back. See what kind of movie makes. Might as well attack with something. Hopefully he has something big he drops and we can cast it down. Johnny's pride mate, that would be ideal to get rid of. That thing will get huge quick. Let's get rid of it now. And it should be smooth sailing, I believe. Maybe, maybe, we'll see. This is a very good deck, very aggressive, but uh, when it goes the distance, baby, it's a no bueno. Uh, one, two, three, okay, yeah, pay two life. Swoosh. I mean, technically, yeah, we could swing with both of them. Wouldn't matter. Wouldn't hurt. Another nine. Get that four four. I mean, ugh. that's tough. I don't know how you stop that. Maybe a board wipe. That'd be nuts to get a board wipe. Got him. All right, uh, just a fun build, guys. I mean, I've probably lost almost equal amounts as I've won. Maybe if I get the if if I don't get like screwed on lands, I do pretty well uh, the majority of the time. Really fun deck. Let me know your thoughts um, in the comments below. If there's something you think you you know I missed that you would add to it, it's Angels and Demons. It's fun. Let me know. We'll see you later. 
Um, we're still on. We'll see you later.